in this session let's see why iit guys and nit guys perform better in gate exam or esc exam or in cat exam or gre exam okay or publishing uh, research papers okay why why they do perform well okay or what extra things they have compared to us let us see okay first thing is maybe people can think of they know very well about basics okay basics of engineering no in my life i had experience like uh, i was able to guide uh, many guys from iits or nits okay i never observed their basics are too far better compared to tier 3 engineering colleges so basics is not the main thing okay second thing is maybe we can think of faculties okay faculties from faculties point of view yes there is a difference there is a difference okay so this is tier 3 engineering college faculties and second thing is let me explain here iit faculties okay normally tier 3 even many students were asking me sir in our college uh, better faculties were not there that's why we were unable to understand these things when while we were studying btech point here is most of the guys i cannot say like all of the faculties but most of the faculties they are not bad dear they are pathetic they are pathetic because we have to understand okay so they will be given with a payment of monthly 30000 or 35000 or 40 45 50 okay so how can one achiever for example if you get gate top rank okay if you get uh, ntpc job okay will you leave ntpc and are will you leave drd or will you leave any other government job and join as a faculty no in the sense underperformers okay so who couldn't achieve the greatest things only will join because they struggle for survival okay so that is the problem with the survival they don't struggle for excellence they struggle for just survival okay because maybe they will uh, do maybe kind of they will appear for gate exam they will just qualify and after that with that they will uh, go and join any some normal uh, colleges for masters and then after masters if they are pay if they are paid okay B because that is the indian education system is like that okay so the moment payment is less in my life i never worked in any engineering college okay because mine is not struggle for survival but mine is struggle for excellence okay so the moment this is struggle for survival yes okay so they are working for we have to understand that they are working for 50000 okay with 50000 they have to manage the family okay so why one achiever uh, go back to engineering college and join there okay so underperformer underachiever who couldn't achieve good things okay even they'll try to scare you because they did not achieve so they will scare you saying like gate is very big thing okay iits are not meant for us or uh, psus are not meant for us something like that they will try to demotivate you or dissuade you okay that factor is there that factor is there if you think of iit professors or nit professors their life is settled okay they will struggle for excellence they will struggle for excellence but one thing i have to add here they will struggle for excellence in research okay not to teach for btech students not to teach for btech students okay yes they do struggle because their life is settled okay so they do struggle for excellence in research you have to add that in research okay so i know many guys even from different iits i know like already you know right so i should have like uh, complete uh, kind of fortunately or god blessings okay so i have fan base okay so i know many iits or many nits faculties are not good okay because they don't uh, what do you say work for btech teaching okay they work for kind of research many pathetic faculties are there in iits and nits so all together all together if you see from our gate or esc point of view okay faculties doesn't matter of course these guys will try to demotivate you or dissuade you and these guys like they don't do anything okay so from gate point of your ac point of view you don't get such a great inputs with faculties or from faculties in any iits or nits okay or maybe you can think of people work hard okay i don't want to extend this okay no it is not the truth they don't really work hard okay really working hard maybe tier 3 engineering colleges whoever are preparing for gate 
they do better hard work compared to IITLs. Okay. Then what is the difference? Then what is the difference? The difference is only confidence. Confidence. Okay. Because, for example, if I think of NIT partner guy this year, he cracked a first rank. For example, okay, so his junior will be there. His junior will be there. How means in what way his his junior as of now this year final year candidate? Okay, so in what way he will think? My senior cleared a gate exam with first rank, so I am capable for it. Is the feeling okay? Always uh, clearing competitive exam is a mind game. Okay, so it's just a mind game. In his mind, the confidence will be there. Okay, because in premier institutes, if you see, in premier institutes, one if you join, if you are from any premier premier institutes like IITs or NITs, okay, you would see one of your friend or senior or super senior might have started his own entrepreneurship, okay, or one of your senior, okay, might have cleared a cat and might be working in uh, what do you say, I am Ahmedabad, okay. So what what you feel? Okay, so if one of our senior cleared GRE, going to abroad, you feel that's obvious that yes, we are also capable for it. Okay, so that is the confidence that matters. Okay, so that is the confidence that matters. Now, basically, okay, confidence they will have, that's obvious. Okay, that's why normally pre-mobility shoots, life will be superb. Because we feel that anything can be achieved. Okay, one gate topper will be there, one IES topper will be there, one guy was uh, may, might be preparing for civil services. Okay, one of your super senior might have cleared IAS. Okay, so that is the only difference between premier institutes and tier three engineering colleges. From examination point of view, that's it. Okay, now let us see how to gain that confidence. How to gain that confidence? Okay, first thing is, first thing is, act confident. Okay, act confident because if you start acting confident, one day you will become confident. Okay, so always feel like gate exam is meant for us. Okay, so I am capable to crack gate. Always act, act. After some duration, you will become very much confident. Okay, so first act. Second thing is keep small, small targets. Okay, so small targets, and once you reach the target, celebrate it celebrate it celebration does not mean that like okay it's not like that okay but uh, for example in order to complete maybe stability okay stability of one of the topic in power systems maybe if you think to complete stability if you feel maybe three days are required okay so take five days take five days don't think that my preparation is going to be delayed and all not required okay so take five days for it Maybe by today evening, you feel like maybe let me solve five questions only, only five problems, only five problems. Okay. So by today evening, if you feel if your commitment is like, okay, if your schedule or if your plan is, let me complete these five questions, five problems. Okay. So try to complete well ahead and stop there. Feel it, feel it. Feeling like, okay, yes, I cracked it. Means I reached my target. I reached my target. Celebrate it. Happiness will come okay automatically confidence will be increased confidence will be increased okay and third thing is third thing is always always go with old gate or ies papers okay i'm not saying means before starting any chapter before starting any subject any subject first take old gate and old ESC. i'm not saying try to solve it okay so for example maybe again stability Okay, so if you are about to start stability, don't try to study first, but take the old gate book first. Okay, in old gate, in stability, from stability, how many questions came, in which areas they have given questions. Okay, such that our mind will be ready, our mind will be ready to capture that. Okay, so in stability, okay, these, 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 these areas, maybe they can ask questions. Okay, now whenever you are uh, preparing, you are studying those, those, those areas, automatically your mind will capture that particular thing and it, it will go to your permanent memory. Okay, because you focus it there, you focus it there. Okay, so always first old, old gate or IES or whatever it may be, try to go through them first. Okay, so before starting machines or before starting controls or before starting networks, just to take it and go through it first go through it first then automatically your mind know how to do the work and all okay so first go with old gate resc and next thing is 
our uh, guys, IIT guys, okay, they don't focus on pity things, small, small things, okay, very small, small things also, for example, maybe in a machine, okay, so for uh, what they say, outer, okay, will they use maybe cast iron or will they use which type of iron, okay, are they important for us, maybe for example, transformer oil, this is a very popular question, okay so what is transformer oil what is the chemical composition of transformer oil will it come in gate exam or ESC exam no no okay basically while studying we have to study in two ways okay first thing is gate and second thing is interviews interviews beyond that we should not think about rest of the things construction of the machine not required okay construction of insulation not required okay so they don't focus on petty things they don't focus on petty things okay are kind of i can say i should not use this word but i have to use the same word because that word is very popular unnecessary research they don't do unnecessary research they don't do they don't do you also don't do our research okay definitely we have to analyze the things okay if we don't analyze the things we don't own the things if we don't own the things own the things how can we perform better that's true but at the same time don't focus on small small pity pity things okay and next thing is next thing is always feel as if you are a topper okay so just to go and wear his shoes go into his shoes topper shoes okay so just always feel you are a topper okay feel as if if i am a topper what i would do now okay so you are you are, you, you should feel like you would be the topper next year okay in that way if you feel automatically your mind will tell you where to focus where not to focus okay so just if you start any topic feel okay if i'm the topper okay how i will see this particular concept okay so just always feel like that at the same time don't focus on pretty pretty small small things okay and so means like uh, go in his shoes okay always feel like you are a topper okay if you are a topper how your preparation would be okay prepare in the same line prepare in the same line don't think like uh, one of the guy was saying i think uh, two days before sir in my college uh, i am the topper i asked like what is your gate rank no sir i just qualified because all of my remaining uh, college college classmates failed is it an achievement is it an achievement no qualifying gate getting 10,000 rank in gate it is not an achievement it is not an achievement means if you get 10,000 rank and uh, if you want to what they say share that experience as like achievement okay you will go to the struggle to survive category you don't come to struggle to excel category okay so if you target gate or ESC you have to reach your target you have to reach your target okay now next thing is short notes okay so short notes should be properly prepared short notes should be properly prepared okay how to prepare short notes very simple i'll give you one example it means today only i will uh, release uh, one of my machines okay means important points to remember points to remember in machines i made uh, one note of course long back i think uh, two three years back okay within 10 pages within 10 pages i was able to keep complete machine content okay so complete machine content of 145 hours okay i was able to fit in only 10 pages because that too i means i clearly have written i have clearly have written the concepts kind of okay i was unable to fill more than 10 pages so you please take that as reference okay in our telegram channel i'll post okay you please take that as reference and prepare short notes because our short notes should be shortest cute concise very much concise okay that way if you can prepare it because that is meant for revision not to copy and paste complete textbook or copy and paste complete video content it is not like that okay so it should be shortest cutest so take that as reference or while studying maybe let me tell you let me show you here this particular book i prepared when i was in btech third year networks okay so i don't know whether you will be able to see it from there or not see here here only i have written okay here only i have written the important point okay if you if i see here okay if you are able to see see these are the uh, exercise questions i did not take separate page at all i did not take separate book at all because it's my habit it's my habit if i take any textbook i'll complete see here 
okay so all the problems i solved here only i solved here only if you see anywhere anywhere okay so means complete complete book anywhere see here okay or uh, let me show one more time maybe one more page yeah see here okay so everywhere i i i have done my work there only and this book is with me for my lifetime okay this is haitan kemerli of course okay at that time very popular okay so in that way means try to learn yourself okay so how to study how to study everybody will have their own plan okay if you are habituated to write it on a what do you say book solving the problems you please solve there or directly solve in uh, textbook only like me because that textbook will be with me only you know or with you only you know forever okay now what are the things which will stop you not to go ahead like this okay so the main thing is at starting too much friction will come too much friction will come okay too much friction will come yes okay without opposition energy cannot be transformed this is the universal law okay if you are changing from mediocre guy to yeah what do you say achievable like accomplishment okay so if you are moving from here to here too much friction will come too much opposition will come your mind will not listen okay but you have to digest that okay like lord shiva lord shiva okay when gods and kind of asuras okay when they both helped each other okay kshira sagara mantana we know okay so when both of them helped each other in order to get amrit first what did they come first halahal came first poison came okay so lord shiva has to come he has to take that and then remaining things maybe lakshmi will come money will come okay or maybe later airavat will come at the end amrit will come okay in our life also the same the same means uh, no difference okay if you start anything new first friction should come okay too much friction will come too much poison will come means kind of friction okay later gradually money will come okay if you stop working at money you will not get amrit after money okay maybe remaining things uh, what do you say uh, maybe after money like airavat may come or maybe airavat in the sense vehicle okay so you will get vehicle you will get uh, money but still we should not stop okay maybe before end of our life we may get self satisfaction that is amrit okay till that point we have to work anyway forget about till amrit okay first of all let us think of initial friction yes initially friction will come you have to digest it your mind will not listen to you you have to what do you say care about it okay so digest it gradually convert like this okay so if you can convert in this way okay i am telling you dear iitians are not different okay they are not like we are just humans they are beyond us no no it is not like that okay iitians are also iitians normal human beings okay so but they have their confidence with them okay they don't fear about the future because even if they fail in gate exam okay or esc exam okay they will get campus placement even if they don't get campus placement after one year also if they go ahead with uh, iit certificate or nit certificate they will get job somewhere so they don't scare about their future okay so you also don't scare about the future okay so what are the characteristics they are having let us uh, take let us take okay and then get the best rank okay in this way definitely we can get the best possible rank to all members okay very all the best